Yeah. And I like that, yeah, he's queuing up the blink straight up. So, Look so at their like, movements. Um, Nigma. Everyone's yeah, they found the catch on Poxy. He's trapped in the cogs. He's trying to turn and burst down Kuro, but he's not got enough damage. Kuro's able to heal up with the death pact. And now Nigma, they could try and run out a second. The battery assault chase is attempted onto Tiger, but Mikke's coming on the back lines. He's running down the SF Miracle. He needs help. Is he going to get it? It's Weehar's Mikre. already split up. He's looking towards Insania, trying for an easy dual kill. Miracle will fall. Mind Control turns up in time with the control onto Mikke. Do they have the damage? The pull up hook shot from GH. They're trapped in the Firefly. Mikke, he's burning low, but the Spirit Siphon keeps him alive. Koifer comes in with a lifesteal and Liquid. They take down a third hero, and they're not done yet. They're looking at Weeha. Weeha will go for the TP out, and he nice. makes it away. Nothing to cancel it. So the attention onto him straight away. They find Mikke. Can they take him out? Boxy's going to be in with a Hoost on, but it's not enough to save Mikke. Mikke will fall with the Soulbind and the two-man Telekinesis. Both Weeha and Mind Control lift it up, and it's just thrown down to their death. It's Kuro. He's got the Dust. Skeleton walk Dust. back up, and they have got that detection. Boxy's in with the vision required. As Liquid take down three more sort of chilling on the cliff. They're going to pop the ghost. Oh, outside of the pit, Boxy with a good breed. Jumps in onto Weehar to make sure that he can't get him. The hook shot, GH is in. But already, Roshan dies to Liquid and Koifa's able to grab the Aegis. They kill off the clock and now they could just run down the remainder of Nigma that's been left behind, hanging around the pit. Weehar will get slowly beaten down. Two more kills for the Spider. Continued lasso stolen by Tiger. Oh. BKBTP will save him in. That's Charging really good finish they get the jump on Tiger, but Liquid, they should have a shot at turning this one. The Soulbind on the two of them. Mikke is ready to chase down with the Siphon and the slow from Insania. Connecting on both We Are and Mind Control. Good jump from Boxy. Gets in on top of the Batrider. The Batrider will fall. We are trying to fight back, but he's surrounded by the Spiders and taken down low by the Siphon. Two more for Liquid. We have Duel coming up. Insania? Insania? He's got it. They jump in. They found the Grimstroke. They can turn around for more miracles being committed on them. Mir both Mickey and Boxy get off the back line. Again, Tiger's now playing with the stolen Requiem into the stolen duel there. Tiger need the spiders to do damage to, to these towers. GH. Where did he come from? Back lines. He just goes for the hook shot. We're gonna find out where he's gonna go in a second here as he's silenced. He's still killing off Insania inside the base. They move in. Weeha goes for the duel to hold down Boxy. Have they got the damage? They've lost Miracle. Kuro, can he finish off this Centaur? It doesn't look like he can. Boxy, who stunts him down? He is dead and gone. Kuro and Enigma's Miracle without buyback. to 37k down. They True. have a in that one. We are. Looks for the commitment. It's going to jump straight in onto Mikke. They're looking to find him, but this bat is just getting shredded. Bat is dead. Red Grim is off, though. They blow up the Death Prophet. They'll look over towards Koifa. Koifa with the BKB. BKB is about to end, but he still has the edges. Boxy. Huge oh, jump. Rick three man who's stop. Tiger. The stolen Red Grim again for the second time this game. This Rubik just styling on Nigma. Oh. This is the bat. So, bottom lane also. That they're just getting in everywhere, uh, Nigma. They dive in, they, uh, it's, it's just a brawl. All across the map, bottom lane, Kuro is going for the TP away, and he, oh, oh, wait, oh, he, make, he makes it. <laughs> All right, well, we'll have to keep our eyes on both Koikfoot. And we are uh, as mid lane. Remember, no global now, so Meepo has to position himself. Oh, Koikfoot is in trouble. He has got oh. the lifesteal, he's trying to turn, but he's dead, and that's it. GG is cool. <laughs> As Nigma, they kill off the brood. They, they did it, S4. Oh no, I shouldn't have said that. But... <laughs> yeah, we don't want the viewers to tune out. Everyone, stick around. We could have a turnaround, right? Don't you don't you cannot don't take everything that S4 says as gospel. I know it's easy to do because he normally gets it right. He's looking forward to to turning this one mid lane. Well, this could be a second time though, quite. But oh no, he's no, dead. No. Global silence has popped. They move over towards Boxy. Mind Control is ready to charge towards the back lines. Great shards catching both Tiger. And Insania. And as much as we try to, to sort of sugarcoat it as far. And that, that was because what, every sort of the way he moved around the map early on and, and yeah. used his early exorcisms was, was bang on. Yeah. And uh, here we go, the top fights. They're going to they get it. They are going to get mind control. It's going to be the buyback from Tiger in an attempt to try and turn this. There's the silence we have, of course. He still has the Aegis. They'll burn through it the once. Uh, they can we, have a second time. we have a snowball. And they go, looking for Weehar. They're on top of him. Boxy's got some good damage with the, the actual silence. step. Snowball will save the Meepo for now. Now Miracle and Kuro have turned up. Global is out. Enigma, they're ready to turn off the back of this second life of Meepo. Mikke just gets shredded by the army of the Meepo as he falls. Liquid have to get out of this. Miracle trying to chase Koifa. But with the webs and the Aghanim's movement speed, Koifa will live. He gets away. Kuro. 
still hunting for more. GH has got the shards available. The vision's on to Tiger. Shard control, not quite there, but the snowball does connect. GH is in. Tiger, he's able to turn that with a fade pole. Can he get this as well? He cannot. He does fall. They're smart players. Oh, they certainly are. You know, the accolades they've picked up over the years. and I mean, absolutely a sort of style we'll see from, from their drafting, and Puppy in particular, you know, the classic sort of, we lost game one with this draft, let's pick the exact same draft and, and show them that we can beat them with it. And it, it's, it's worked for them. And obviously this series, uh, definitely that conversation, I think it paid off. Nygma is hitting back in this game two, insanely hard. They've stepped up the play. They have come in with an excellent draft as well here, finding a perfect playing field for the Meepo to, to execute his game plan. And they're 15k up, 30 to, to 20 right now. Meepo's back in, on to Quake. No, it is a Meepo now, so... He's still playing incredibly one. aggressive, though. Uh, he's got to be a little careful now with the soul buy. Maybe Mickey can turn for the setup, but We Are is just so fat right the now. Pipe. Can they kill this Meepo? It would be a huge kill if they could. Tiger's trying to get yeah. in. They get him. Meepo is gone, and maybe Liquid can find more. They get the drag back with the Remnant placement onto Kuroki. Heals up with the Death Packs. He's trying to bring down Insania, and he's been silenced. He still has the Skeleton Ward, but they're prepared with the dust. Liquid, they hit back. They kind of proved it this game. Here we go, mid lane. The this is the best target, if they can bring him down. He is the big damage dealer and the, the nuisance for Weeheart. Can they finish him during this global? It's getting low. They're on top with the snowball. They finish him off. They get the kill on Mickey. Boxy's going to jump forward with the dissimulate. Quick burst onto Tiger on the back lines. He's gone. They have lost three on Liquid. Over towards Quake for mind control. Does he want to continue to chase? He'll let him go with the movement speed that he has under the web. As the spider will survive. We'll see what objective Nigma wants to try and take. Kerr is like, come by him. Come on, guys. <laughs> He wants to keep building up that death pack damage. I mean, he's doing very well for himself so far. What jump does he want to make? He's looking towards Mickey. Yeah. He's going to start playing around with the timber. The rest of Nigma going for the wraparound, looking for Quake from the back lines. They'll go for the snowball play onto Tiger. Global silence is pop. Mickey, he needs help. They've got to try and keep this timber alive. He's been e bladed. The root control from Weehar continues into the poop. Mickey's gone. Jump across from Boxy, but Nigma, they'll continue to chase this. Another net, not going to quite clip Boxy this time. The second one, it does though. Weehar hits the target, hits the mark onto this. Poor old boy spirit. They go. The resonant pulse gives him a little protection, but it's not nearly enough. Yeah, I would have preferred him to pull that catapult wave. Rather. Look at the bottom though. It's I mean, they're diving. McKay's a little too deep for them to get to though. He's able to stand back in the trees. Tiger still has a fish to play with. He's going to lay it down onto Kuro. Vision's out with the sentry. One more slow from a frost arrow will not be enough for Tiger to get the kill. He oh, cannot stay on top of Kuro. Now Nigma can turn and take a second. As jump forward from Miracle onto Tiger. Gets them another. Mickey also in trouble. There's a charge Kuro. coming from in. The charge is not even going to be needed. Mickey <laughs> will fall to the three of them. As Nigma come out of these lanes very hot. And they're playing at a pace that's going to be hard to turn. Straight into the face of Mickey and Tiger. Tiger to go down. Mickey is going to be brought a little bit of time thanks to the cold embrace, but there's no way that they can get him out of these heroes. And Weehar just kill on to kill. He's charging on, diving into these tier twos. A TP over will come in from Boxy. He's going to put the option to turn and find a, a huge kill onto Mike Strong. They can get it in time with the fear and the control they do. They take down one GH. He's tried to snowball over to help, but it's a little too late. He's looking for Insania. They will find it. And Weehar, he just charges in over towards Boxy. He's taking tower hits. He's got to run. Quifer's going to be able to get the root off straight away. And Liquid, they will find some kills. Might be Echo Slam moment there. I was trying to move him in. Mind Control is tanky so with the tanky. Ghost Shroud and the heal. And he's got a completed pipe. My they have silenced him. We are able to charge across to take away the pressure from Mind Control. As Mind Control can move away, we are using the ult to nicely jump back away from this attempt at Tiger. It's a great blink. Is it enough damage though? The Fisher back and the arrow. We are going down. He did the uphill miss chance. We are not even going to fall. He gets away from that. The Reaper Scythe is there onto Tiger, so it just ends up being another kill for Nygma. Boxy is able to keep himself on top of the breaker with those phase boots, closing the gap. But this Miracle. fight's not quite over. Nygma, they're rolling in onto Mickey in the river. Koifer using the bear to try and push Nygma away and trying to help Insana and Mickey, but they're being chased down. Koifer turns towards GH, jump forward from Miracle, will get knocked back by the fear. The roots onto GH. Koifer is starting to take some kills himself, but the mana boy from from Miracle brings Mickey down low. It's a double kill for Mind Control. They just cannot deal with this Necrophos right now, it seems, as he still stands tall. Boxy and Insania, they've got to keep their distance. Miracle jumps across, looking towards this Mars. So Boxy Shots. has some movement oh, speed with the face boost to get away. Weeha, 
He's back in the game and he's back to ready to play onto Insania. Does get caught out by the Winter's Curse, but Miracle is able to jump over. Pretty aggressively positioned. He has got backup of all Insania, Boxy, and Tiger. They could turn. They look towards We Are. They knock him back into the arena wall. Quote for comes across as well. GH buys a bit of safety with the snowball, but they still got ults to play with. The Winter's Curse holds down the two of them. Kuro, we're going to wrap him from the back lines, but Tiger jumps forward. Echo Slam of the River onto both We Are and GH. Damage to finish them and they off. They do not. We are still alive. A spear knocks Kuro into the cliff. Quite for spare. Bites him down. But Liquid overall, they've lost three as Nigma are overrunning them. We are cannot escape. Boxy finds the trade. Miracle, GH, and Mind Control are ready to continue running them down. Snowball in from GH, closes the gap on Kuiper. Boxy shows back Miracle with the spear, but he's got to try for this TP out. If they got anything to cancel it, they don't have got that. That information and as soon as Insania starts to step out they're ready to take him away make sure that that threat of the curse is not available for the play they want to make towards mid boxy tries to open up with the arena but already he's lost his sort of two big follow-up ult makers both the wyvern and shaker are down boxy trying to back away we are looking for the next target the scythe takes out mickey mickey has got buyback available they're moving on to quite for quite for with the four man fear knocks them back Boxy able to find the spear onto Weehar. He's under the tier four, taking a lot of damage. They'll kill off the space cows. They push him out with the fear. GH is trying to disrupt things with the snowball, committing into the Roche. There's the arena. They're just holding them back. They've got to try and finish off Roshan. Look, can they do it? Slams out. Tiger secures the zone. They're going to get Roshan and get the Aegis onto Boxy. Liquid, they'll now try and turn and find kills for this. GH will be shot down by Mickey on his way to escaping. They'll use the curse to control Miracle and try and assess the situation, but they're still losing the team fight. They lose Mickey, they lose Insania, and they've lost Blink. the Aegis on him. See if they can do a second time. Excellent Fisher. Struggling a lot. So he can even solve him at this point. Mickey. Mid lane. Ooh, the Napalm is high level. Good stacks into the lasso. Tiger. Yeah, he's still a spear. He's going to after. Oh, good Snowball snow. is there with the counter play. Extra TPs are coming in from Liquid. They're still trying to find quite for the flame break. Not back into the reaches of GH. They have the damage to kill off this bear. They don't. Lone Druid will live. Miracle. He's joined the fight as well. Another dagger over to Koik for jumping He's in underneath armor. the tower. Can they finish him? He's trapped by the shards. Koik is punching back, but Miracle's got the damage with the help of Kuro. Nice play. And the dive's mid lane. I was going to say this. They're trying for Kuro. They do get the root connection here. First hit for Koik for into the nuke from Insania. Now they can turn towards GH. Koik for. Able to, to punch back quite hard here with the help of his Grimstroke. Another root connection. GH with the snowball trying to create the distance. Another root. Quite for just continuously locking down these supports as he's able to pick up a few kills. On control. He's going to turn with a Ray Fire Blast. TP in from We Are. He knows the It's cool, huh? He's low. Ooh, nice blink from Mickey. Gets him out of way, but We Are still chasing. Tiger throws back the bat. Mickey's got another blink to play with. And jump over to Tiger. He's still chasing though. The napalm is stacking up. He has the tricks, as well as another blink. He should the the creep wave's coming up. He'd be able to jump away oh, once more. Okay. We are still chasing. He's got flame break up again. Uh, that knockback that will be the damage required to take down Mickey. Tiger's also ticking down low. Boxy with the TP trying to find the trade kill. He's on top of Weehar. Mike Control's oh, watching from the side. He can throw out the stun. Holds back Boxy for now. He's still going through the tree line, but the time's been created for GH to turn up. Deep snowball straight through to Tiger. Punches him out, takes the Rubik out of the game, and with the flame break, they can continue to dive for more. We are still with the Firefly, good to go. Closes in onto Boxy. Boxy will knock the reincarnate out of mind control, but it costs him his life. Another shards. GH in, controlling Insania. Kuro joins in for a bit of the action as well as Nigma. They overrun them on this top lane. Koifa, he's tried to walk into this, but the snowball's over. He gets the ult off. He is tanky and he does have the fear to push them back. But mind control comes in, slams him out with a crit. Ray fire blast over towards Mickey. Mickey tricks the trade, jumps to the side. Tiger with the high nuke from this Fade Bolt finds at least Weeha's bat. But Liquid, they're just getting dove in past these tier twos. GH again with the shards, locking down Tiger. The damage from Kuro is enough to find the room. Tiger turns with another Fade Bolt. Kuro is getting low. They find the kill. Mickey's still hunting. He knows both Mind Control and GH are here in the trees, but the sentry's down. They see the Ricky. They beat him out as well. Insania, can he clean up these two? Mind Control is TPing out. GH is trying to hide. The Inkswell stun will clip it. But he gets so much stun. You know, the fact he's walking around 15 minutes, he already has plus 30 damage from the death pack. He's 7 2 and Seven, you know, he, he really is onto something with these support clinks plays. Yeah. Always finding a good game for himself. Ah. It's liquid. I'm gonna lose more here. Insania's gone. Mickey tries to get Kuro. We'll find the trade. Jumps over with the tricks of the trade into the Roche pit, but GH laying down these shards, holding him in there for now. He's got another blink to get out, and we'll jump over to the warm embrace of Tiger. 
The Ricky will live. Boxy's still being chased. He has got the primal split, so maybe some opportunity to turn, but he's losing the rest of his team. Tiger as it just relentlessly chased down by Wehar and Miracle. A buyback comes out from Insania. Boxy with the split. They're trying to turn. They're trying to find something in response. So by now onto both Miracle and Mind Control. The two of them locked in place, but Mickey is falling low. The snowball comes in. GH able to keep Miracle safe. They move over towards Insania. It's a dieback on the Grimstroke. Boxy with the last remaining seconds of this ult. Desperately looking for Miracle, but he cannot take him down. Boxy cannot finish the kill. He's getting kited, slowed up. Miracle just watches from a distance as his entire team kills off the brew jumps back in see yeah. what jump they can make mind control they're trying to commit on the wraith king mind control has got reincarnate available so it's going to be dangerous. back a second time as they focus on a boxy boxy pops the split miracle trying to focus quite for snowball over from gh the fear will push him back maybe this is liquid's opportunity to turn the soul bind onto the two of them they're looking towards both of them with the stun coming out for the brewing connecting onto both miracles getting brought low but they've lost quite but gh will buy back miracle's been taken down the once they'll be able to take down mind control a second time boxy split will end we are lasso control onto the mickey ricky as he's gone multiple buybacks are going to have to come out from liquid if they want to hold on to this fight as nigma just look to take this one yet again over oh. to insania he's stuck he's just gonna sort of hang on as they they just watch a little bit of peace a little bit of solace here for, for insania a little bit of mercy apart from kuro kuro turns up and says boys stop messing around we've got a game to win it's time to kill him off five dead on liquid